Dices on the beat channel and if you're new hi i'm sin and welcome to my channel and this is video three in my bbl series this is pre-op surgery day and post-op vlog pre-op i really did not record because stuff was just not going right it was really stressing me out all day but the lord i was make away everything still worked out smooth i just my own flight was late so that pushed things back Pre-op took so long, which all we did was sign papers, but it was just with so many people in there. I don't know why they booked so many people in the same day, but yeah, so all they was sign papers. They figured out if I needed to buy anything from them, which I, I bought nothing from them. Um, you had to go to accounting to make sure that your stuff is paid in full. And then you just went, got your pictures taken, and that was really it, and you, you left. But after I left, which I'm in the hotel room now, but after I left, I went to Pretty Pretty Girl Curves. I got my BBL pillow, the back part. They go for your back. I had got my Faha and stuff, which you guys will see all that tomorrow. But I got everything from them for a pretty affordable, affordable price. So, yeah, but I'm going to just go ahead and give you guys, like, a little video of me beforehand. So, this is me in all my glory. This little suit, let me show everything about this. I'm gonna lift up and I'm gonna stop sucking in. So this is me from the front. <laughs> from the side. Yeah, yeah, I don't, I've been doing a lot with the stomach. And then my other side of the side. And then from the back. So, <laughs> so y'all ready to see what I look like when I come out. My surgery is at 7 in the morning. I cannot eat for eat or drink for 12 hours. It is currently like 8 or 9. And I'm about to shower and stuff. When you shower, you cannot um, put on anything. Like when you got the shower, you draw off and you go to bed. So I'm going to get in the shower, draw off, put on my bonnet, put on my outfit. That I'm wearing into surgery. I just got me a little two piece that button up because you don't want it to go over your head. And then I'll be ready for tomorrow. It still didn't really hit me yet what's going on. Like, I'm like mad excited. I'm mad appreciative all day. I've just been like, thank you, God. Like, thank you for all of these. Like, just thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm ready to be. You know what I'm saying? But yeah. So, I'm just going to continue doing what I'm supposed to do and get ready for tomorrow. I'm going to try to record as much as possible tomorrow, but as you know, I'll be under anesthesia, so I will be basically in and out of sleep all day because, like, it makes you mad tired. But, yeah, so I'm about to take a shower, get ready for bed. I done packed all my bags to go to the recovery house, which I guess I can show you guys all my bags. These are all my bags. This is literally all of my BBL supplies. This has the stuff I'm taking after surgery with me, my BBL stuff, and then drinks and stuff for me to eat. Yeah, you guys, time is ticking. You know, I'm ready to tell the, the Facebook group, see you on the flat side. So, yeah, but you guys stay tuned.
My doctor, he's really nice. Dr. Dylan. It's not worth it. I'm not gonna do it, girl. I was just thinking about it. I'm not gonna do it. I did it. Are you feeling? Just tight. I'm okay, though. Hey, y'all. So, I'm at recovery. It's honestly not that bad. Just sore. Oh, just took my medicine. <sighs> so, I'm just about to lay down, honestly. So, yeah. Excuse me. Yeah. Still as she is, fuck. <laughs> uh -oh. I'm about to take me a cough drop. I'm not about to start that coughing mess. But, yeah, so. Good morning. Excuse my voice, my throat hurts. But this is day one, post op. I'm just kneeling and trying to eat. I got my post op appointment today and a massage. But yeah, so I got my getting a massage, get the shower, and that's really it for today. But I'm gonna try to vlog my massage if she lets me, so that you guys can see like what she doing stuff. But I'm here at Kila's Recovery. Highly recommend her. Like again, I'm gonna have her Instagram down below. If you're coming to Miami and getting something done, I highly recommend coming here. So, yeah, I'm just kneeling and enjoying my kneeling because it feels so much better than laying down. Like, and I got this little train. I just ordered one for the house because it feels so good to kneel on. But, yeah. My face look a little swole because I've been sleeping on my face. But, yeah. So, I'll come back when we do something. I can't even eat like I want to. I get full. <sighs> but, yeah, I'm probably about to take my vitamins. And then, just stay kneeling and be on my phone. So I just got from post op. All they did was take pictures. <laughs> Nothing else, but they just took pictures. So when I get back to the house, I'll be getting my massage and then hopefully just I'll feel better after that. Lunch, chicken noodle soup, and these crackers are the good as well. And I'm drinking this vitamin juice from Whole Foods. Hey guys, it's day 
post out day two. And I just woke up from another nap. I done had my second massage. I highly recommend taking your pain medicine before. I didn't. I woke up too late to do that. So I felt it a little more today. But I'm about to take a shower. If I can get a video of me before the shower so you guys can see, I will. But I haven't really been vlogging much because I've just been sleeping. Like I've been sleeping and I be up at night. I sleep in the day, up at night. So. I'm gonna try to get a video of what I'm looking like two days. Yeah, yeah I'm, I'm still on like medicine. I only take uh, like prescribed pain medicine once a day before my massage, and then I just feed on the gummies and um take Tylenol. So I'm doing okay. I just started my period. <laughs> well, but yeah, so I have like a diaper on right now, but I'm gonna see what. I'm gonna end up doing either like getting tampons or wearing the pads I brought or just wearing a diaper <laughs> on the day. But <clears throat> it's 11 in the morning and drink some water and then I'm gonna go take a shower. So y'all remember key love recovery. But I'm just trying to eat. I can't eat. But I'm just gonna try to eat this. And I done took my medicine. 
just let it try to kick in for my massage. I took the oxy to help. But yeah, I'm probably just about to go brush my teeth and wash my face. And I'm whispering because my roommates are sleeping. But yeah, I need to wait on my massage. Just a word of advice, take your pain medicine on time for your massages. Mine wore off and I cried, hard cried. But other than that, I just been laying here eating some fruit. Um, I'm gonna try to get a video of what I look like. Either probably before my shower because this is starting to look I'm so it's my swelling going down little by little every day again I'm whispering because my roommates are sleeping but I leave tomorrow so I'm probably in this vlog today so I'm gonna show you what I'm looking like if I get my next massage today I might try to show you if not then I'll probably just show you my body and in the vlog hopefully this is a very enjoyable not enjoyable but informative vlog about bbls um the recovery um about cg cosmetics my doctor dr dylan all the other stuff so but yeah i'm just laying here i eat some fruit watching tv um calling my people because i miss them oh yeah i miss home and i miss my family so bad but yeah Hey guys so i'm home now i'm in my um well i'm at my parents house i'm in their bathroom i'm just uh, i'm just filming the outro for this video basically i want to let you guys know my last day was a mess okay so number one my last two massage massages was it was so painful i did not know why there was just something else well my first time my medicine wore off the second time i don't know why it still was very painful but my first three were okay. My last two were not. Um, At the recovery house, the lady who was over it, she left. Didn't know she left. Um, she was the main one that spoke English. Most of everybody else spoke Spanish and like a little bit of English. So it made it very troubling to do anything because they didn't know what you were trying to do. Um y'all if i sound tired it's because i really am y'all like getting surgery will take all your energy but so then the day that i was leaving they was rushing me out um they have drivers that's supposed to drive you everywhere i'm sorry i'm just looking at my face they have drivers that are supposed to drive you everywhere they called me an uber <laughs> a uber who did not have like a pillow or nothing in their car that just drove any type of way 
um they wash your clothes and stuff there y'all why today i'm leaving i look because you know i'm just talking to the girl and i look i'm like girl i got a dress just like that like where you get yours from it's my dress hold on but yeah y'all it's my dress that she got on <laughs> they washing clothes and just doing whatever like i'm pretty sure two of the dresses that i brought up there i don't have and two pair of socks that i brought up there i don't have because they didn't they had it was like getting to be so many girls that they was getting confused with the clothes but i just said bump it man I'm, it's time for me to go i'm ready to go home get to the airport it was just so much like y'all my last my me trying to get home was just a mess but overall it was not a bad experience it was it was an experience though but anybody who's going to get surgery or going to do anything i say listen to people reviews take it into consideration but don't use what they say to go off of because a lot of people that i watched said that everything was so bad it hurt so much this that and the third but me and me getting the surgery it wasn't that bad like it's not that bad i just got to now recover wait on the fluff fairy to come and get these massages so that my stomach can get right and everything else so don't listen to everything just take into consideration and that's it don't go off of what other people say to be for what you think gonna happen to you whatever but i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did make sure you like comment and subscribe Hopefully, I will see you guys in the next one. This is Sin signing off. Peace.